Hello and welcome to the CA Technologies video series. In this video, we'll show you how to get started with CA ArcServe Central Host-Based VM Backup. Protecting a virtual environment is challenging when you have to install software components in every guest operating system. In this video, we'll show you how CA ArcServe Central Host-Based VM Backup can detect all virtual machines running on a host in a single pass so you can protect them without having to install software components on every guest OS. Let's get started. Launch the application from the Windows Start menu. You'll need a server to act as your backup proxy, where you should already have installed and configured CAARCServe D2D R16 with VDDK. You'll also need to download and install the VIX API on this proxy. This is required for granular restores. Finally, you'll need access credentials for the vCenter server and the virtual machines you want to protect. For complete configuration instructions, see the documentation. This is the home page. From here, you can launch the application's protection tasks. Click Node. The first thing you should do is add the nodes you want to protect. You can add nodes automatically using the Auto Discover feature or manually using the Import Virtual Machines option. Auto Discovery monitors the servers you added. When new VMs are detected, you're asked if you want to add those nodes. Select the nodes to add and click the right arrow to add them to the Nodes to Protect list. Then click Next. Enter credentials for each VM on your list. And click Finish. To protect the nodes that you've added, click Policies. On this screen, you can create new CA ArcServe D2D policies and then assign them to the nodes that you added. For more information on creating backup policies, view the CA ArcServe D2D videos. To assign a policy, first select it and then click the Assign Unassign tab. From the list on the left, click the virtual machines you want to protect. Click the right arrow to add them to the selected nodes list. Click OK. The display status column lets you know when the nodes are protected. Click View Logs to see any messages that were collected. If one of your protected virtual machine fails, click Restore. First, choose a node and then choose the Restore option. You can restore a backup session, a file, a folder, or recover the entire VM. That's it. You're now ready to get started with CA ArcServe Central Host-Based VM Backup. For more information on this and other central applications, please visit the website where you can obtain the full product documentation or view the remaining videos in the series. Thanks for watching.